In this project, I'm going to be using the Titanium Flux 125 welder I just purchased from Harbor Freight. I thought it might be a good idea to show you how it did. I have other welders, both MIG and TIG, but I prefer using flux core when welding zinc hardware. For this reason, I purchased a dedicated flux core welder, the Titanium Flux 125. Okay, on with my project. I needed to create a set of bases for these nut and bolt chest pieces I was working on. Each chest piece needs a 3 8 inch nut welded to a 3 8 inch washer to form the base. I decided to use the flux core process to weld the two pieces together, hence the titanium flux 125. Both flux core and zinc welding produce some pretty nasty fumes. For this reason, I will be using my CNC construction set plasma downdraft table. I used a bolt and a third hand to help hold things in place while I did the welding. I welded the nut to the washer in three places. After a little wire brush cleanup, this is what the pieces look like. I'm very happy with this weld. Since I had 32 of these bases to make, I thought I'd make myself a fixture so I could streamline the process a little bit. The fixture is simply a piece of one and a half inch steel angle mounted on my simple plasma fixture described on my website. Despite the old consumables I'm using, I got very little dross on this part, so I won't have to do much cleanup. I sandwich a washer between two nuts and place these four assemblies on the fixture. I do a quick check to make sure I have continuity between the pieces and my table. Now, I can weld four parts at a time. This should really help me speed up the process. Mm -hmm. 
The settings I'm using on the titanium are uh, volt C and wire speed 5. After I make four welds, I just twist them and repeat the process. last side I clean the parts with a stainless steel wire brush. Cleans up really nice. So here are the 32 welded bases, all nice and cleaned up, ready for chess piece assembly. Here are some pawns that are assembled. I'm very happy with the Titanium Flux 125. It, it, it performed perfectly for what I asked it to do. We'll be doing a video on the actual chess set build in the near future, so stay tuned for that. So in any case, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.